we want to simplify each expression. Our first expression is the quantity 24 minus 18a divided by 6. Notice in this case we're dividing by a single term or a monomial. So whenever dividing by a monomial, we divide each term in the numerator by the denominator. So the given expression is equal to 24 divided by 6 minus 18a divided by 6. And now we want to simplify each fraction. Well, 24 divided by 6 simplifies perfectly to 4. 18a divided by 6 simplifies perfectly to 3a. So we have 4 minus 3a, which is the simplified expression. But normally when writing algebraic expressions, we do want the variable terms first followed by the constants. So let's rewrite this as negative 3a plus 4. This expression is okay, but this expression would be more common. So our answer will be negative 3a plus 4. Next we have 5y plus the quantity 36 plus 63y divided by 9. So this is going to be equal to 5y and then plus 36 divided by 9 plus 63y divided by 9. And now simplifying the fractions, we have 5y, 36 divided by 9 equals 4, so we have plus 4. 63y divided by 9 is equal to 7y, so we have plus 7y. Notice how we have like terms, we have two y terms here and here. 5y plus 7y is equal to 12y, so this simplifies to 12y plus 4. Looking at our next expression, we first want to simplify the numerator by distributing the 6 here. So we would have 6 times 15w, that's 90w. And then 6 times negative 30 is negative 180, so we have minus 180. And then we still have plus 25. All this is divided by 5. Still simplifying the numerator, we do have like terms. Negative 180 plus 25 is equal to negative 155. So we have 90w minus 155 all divided by 5. And now we'll divide each term in the numerator by 5. So we have 90w divided by 5, minus 155, divided by 5. Well, 90w divided by 5 is equal to 18w, minus 155 divided by 5 is equal to 31. So we have 18w minus 31. Our last example is very similar. We first want to simplify the numerator here, so we'll distribute 4. 4 times 6c is 24c, and then 4 times negative 9 is negative 36, so minus 36, and we still have plus 12. All this is divided by 3, and we have plus 10c minus 9. We can combine the like terms here. Negative 36 plus 12 is negative 24, so we have 24c minus 24 divided by 3 and then we still have plus 10c minus 9. We're running short on room so let's finish this on the next slide. For our next step we'll divide both terms in the numerator by 3 so we'll have 24c divided by 3 minus 24 divided by 3 plus 10c minus 9. Simplifying our fractions 24c divided by 3 is 8c, minus 24 divided by 3 is 8. And finally, combining like terms, we have two c terms, and we have two constants. So 8c plus 10c is 18c, and negative 8 minus 9 is negative 17, so we have minus 17. So our simplified expression is 18c minus 17. I hope you found this helpful.